You're also saying that you expect the PBOC uh, to cut the triple R by a total of 100 basis points in Q2 and Q3. Does the Chinese economy warrant that, need that kind of stimulus from the PBOC? Uh, yes, indeed. First is, is this is to support the fiscal policy. Uh, in order to support the infrastructure investment, the local government special bond issuance uh, is likely to be even larger than last year. And the central bank will have to uh, inject uh, adequate liquidity in the system in order to facilitate the insurance issuance of those bonds and prevent uh, an increase of the government bond yield. And in the meantime, to prevent uh, crowding out of credit to the private sector. Uh, so triple R cut, uh, 100 basis point in total would be needed in our view based on our calculation to keep money and credit growth slightly above the nominal GDP growth. Uh, in other words, uh, the PBOC uh, will have to tolerate a temporarily moderate increase of the macro leverage. Uh, Shuang, what can you tell us about the domestic economy in China and how the domestic demand environment is faring? Because if we saw the trade balance numbers yesterday, uh, it seems like, you know, with the pickup in imports, uh, things are looking pretty strong. Now, that can also be, mind you, a function of the 4% gain that the yuan has staged over the course of the last four months. Uh, and that also helping sentiment when it comes to uh, the pickup in export or the growth in exports. Uh, yes, uh, I think domestic demand was very weak for most part of uh, 2019, uh, partly because of the deleveraging of uh, 2018. Uh, it has a one-year lag uh, on domestic demand. So uh, import was quite uh, weak, actually, for most part of 2019. Uh, for the year as a whole, China's imports dropped by 2.8%, but it picked up toward the end of the year, uh, which means uh, China's policy to... Uh, uh, the, the expansion of fiscal policy together with the more accommodative monetary policy start to show some effect. Uh, so the domestic demand uh, is likely to pick up, uh, mm. starting with the, the infrastructure investment, and also consumption may also improve, uh, partly because of less of a drag from the, uh, of the car sales. Uh, so 2020, uh, we think uh, the external demand seems to have uh, improved a little bit, uh, partly because uh, 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 the phase one trade deal with the U.S. Uh, and also with the support of policy and some cyclical tailwinds, uh, that would provide support to China's growth.